and welcome to Bladen Online. This week's top news stories, our Bladen County Schools held their opening day convocation on Tuesday, welcoming back teachers. Um, some faces are familiar to folks and there are also some new folks joining our staffs at Bladen County Schools and on Tuesday they met and they got energy going and just getting ready for the new year. Um, heard some wonderful news. At it's about some performance of some of our schools and how well they're doing. Also, our Summer Sounds Concert Series just wrapped up another successful year. Uh, the concert, the final concert was held on Thursday night with Blackwater Rhythm and Blues and it was very well attended. More than 800 people showed up to shag the night away. And plans are already underway for another event next year. Also, um, the state has DO DOT has released a 10-year state transportation improvement plan and this plan um, lays out projects that are slated for the next 10 years and in that plan there were several projects that were indicated to take place in Elizabethtown including some widening of NC 87 and also some improvements to take place at the Elizabethtown Industrial Park and the Curtis L. Brown Jr. Field. Uh, for more on that, you can go to bladenonline.com. Also, the Dublin Peanut Festival will be holding its annual cooking contest. There will be prizes for the first, second, and third place winners. Uh, for more information about that, you can contact Sandra Kane at the um, Bladen County Cooperative Extension Office at 910-862-4591 and she'll be glad to get you all the information that you need to enter the Peanut Festival Cooking Contest. One requirement is that whatever recipe you submit must contain peanuts as an ingredient. And for this and more stories you can go to bladenonline.com.